We now want to ram a solid nozzle in one end of one of our paper tubes. I'm going to use this brass plumb bob to just taper those inside edges of the tube inside waller to make sliding it onto the tooling and sliding the rammer into the tube a little bit easier. I'm going to put the tube onto the tooling base nice and square and all the way down. I'll take a slightly rounded half teaspoon of bentonite clay, put the funnel in the tube, put the clay into the funnel, tap the funnel till all the clay is down into the tube, and then using my beveled end nozzle rammer, I'll slide that all the way down into the tube. You can see before it's rammed, I've got about a half inch between my sharpie mark in the top of the tube. When I'm done ramming a nozzle, I want that sharpie mark to be just about even with the top of the tube. I'm going to give this eight nice solid wax. Not so hard that I split the tube, but, but hard enough to really consolidate the clay in there. And when I'm done, I should be able to feel a slight bulge in the tube, right where that nozzle's getting rammed. See my mark is getting down close to the top of the tube. I don't feel any bulge yet. Yeah, now I've got just a little bit of a bulge there. My mark is getting down close to the top of the tube, right about where I want it. I remove my rammer. Tap my excess clay back into the tub of it. And there I have a nice solid nozzle rammed in the tube. I can remove the tube from the tooling and see that nozzle recessed up in there. It doesn't have the hole in it yet. We're going to create that hole after we ram the fuel and the top bulkhead.